Hello all, today I will be doing a demo on the Philips Champion radio. It is also called uh, RL384. Uh, it is a 4 band radio. Uh, it is an analog uh, radio which, which has 4 bands. Medium wave, short wave, 1, 2 and uh, FM. So you can see the dial here. And this is the box. This is a Philips uh, uh, Sabse Badia signal. The, it's an analog uh, radio. So you can see the manufacturing details. So it's available both in the offline and online market. The price is mentioned here as 2199, but I paid only 1700. So you can see the dial. So this Philips is a very popular uh, radio. Uh, it's budget friendly, multi-band, uh, it's a po very portable radio. It supports uh, FM, medium wave, that is using amplitude modulation, short wave and its uh, sound output is uh, 500 milliwatts. RMS I am talking about via a 4 inch speaker, this is a 4 inch speaker which is uh, used as a speaker here and the power source it uses uh, 3 D size R20 batteries and it has also got a DC socket, you can see the DC socket provided here. It says 4.5 DC, 4.5 volt DC and uh, here is the mode selection uh, switch selector where you can uh, select uh, medium wave, short wave, FM and the short wave, uh, short wave bands. This is the band. So you can see that FM it's mentioned as 88 to 108 and medium wave 520 kilohertz to 1600 medium wave and short wave 31 meters to 13 meters and uh, short wave to the 90 meters to 31 meters so we'll see the demo we'll i'll power on the radio and give a demo so now i've uh, selected the fm band uh, so you can see the audio quality you can hear the audio quality size the FM, FM AM reception is very good it's very loud clear audio with very minimum distortion and the battery life with the batteries 3 R20 batteries are pretty decent I've been using from last uh, three weeks uh, for uh, at least three to four hours in a day and it's running fine So uh, coming to the hardware, uh, 
hardware circuit of the this radio philips uh, champion radio also called uh, rl384 it's made in india and it's in india specific uh, radio this uses the famous dsp ifc dsp that from the si 4825a dsp based rf tuner ic though it's analog this chip enables high quality af fm mw and short wave reception with minimal interference so this dsp si 4825a it's a dsp so si 4825 is a 10 uh, version dsp tuner ic which does the on board if filtering see the short wave bands uh, are uh, from the frequency range of 3 megahertz to 30 megahertz they are used for long distance communication uh, so short wave uh, communications are used in uh, used by there are uh, various stations for international broadcasting done by bbc voa air external services amateur ham radio aviation and maritime communication emergency communication so you can see here it is in the dial that it's mentioned as for short wave 31 meters to 16 meters so we have uh, different uh, bands uh, the 120 meter band that is from 2.3 megahertz to 2.5 megahertz th that is used for uh, tropical broadcasting 90 meters that is 3.2 to 3.4 megahertz is used for night broadcast 60 meters 4.75 to 5.06 megahertz the i am talking about the meters here it is mentioned in meters but i am also comparing meters to the megahertz so 60 meters uh, that is corresponds to 4.75 to 5.0 regional broadcasting 49 meters band uh, is the global uh, broadcasting band in short wave 5.8 to 6.2 megahertz then the 31 meters 9.4 to 10 megahertz most popular in software uh, radio that is uh, so sh short wave uh, bands and the 19 meters that's daytime dx and for international uh, broadcasting it is 16 meters that is 17.5 to 18 megahertz 16 meter band and the last one is 13 meters band also 11 meters that is 21 to 26 megahertz let's use for uh, broadcasting so let me also discuss about the factors of affecting short wave so time of the day is one parameter uh, night uh, lower short wave frequencies propagate farther uh, due to ionospheric reflection day higher frequencies work better that is uh, so you may get bands uh, 13 to 26 megahertz better in the during the day and in the night that is the lower software frequencies 3 to 10 megahertz so uh, the factors affecting short wave reception is maybe due to that is first is time of the day due to weather conditions and also ionospheric conditions because software uh, sorry short wave short wave uh, radio relies on ionosphere to reflect signals back to the earth also solar activity sunspots solar flares so that is more the sunspots better long distance reception solar stand there is if there is uh, so in a short i can say based on the weather and also uh, interference so if you have lot of electronic noise coming out from a lot of devices like led uh, tvs chargers etc so that may affect uh, the short wave signals then receiver uh, quality also sensitivity sensitivity antenna size all this matters and also the digital tuning and these dsp filters and also the the antenna type the telescopic long wire antennas 
loop antennas. So I, can, I have selected the position short soft uh, short wave one, and I'm uh, adjusting the antenna. This has been continued and maintained for further future. Now I'm playing the short wave radio. I'm listening to. So that's that's just reflecting what happened at this summit or during the summit. I think the one. You can see I'm uh, in short wave one. Doctor Joe, let's take a specimen on this. In waterways, have valleys under this spirit already been demonstrated? <laughs> that experts have already stressed. But I want also add two more points. The first one is that uh, we know China is a developing country, so we have benefit a lot by our experiences in the urbanization and the industrialization. And we all, always want to share our experiences with, with our partners. So, we have already had trying to understand the situation and how can we have a better support on the, some of the weaker part of this uh, you know, different countries. So you can see the here the software reception, the shortwave reception is also very good. Audio reception, very clear. to put ourselves at the interpretation. So in this uh, kind of collaboration between popular uh, radios like Philips have divided the short, short wave to two bands, SW1 and SW2. So SW1 is for lower short wave frequencies, SW2 is for uh, higher uh, short wave frequencies, 3 to 30 megahertz. So, so short wave uh, one is very good in the night and early mornings. So that's why I uh, tuned to short wave one. It's night and it's night time, and uh, you can see it is night. And I've tuned to short wave one. Short wave one. Right now I have tuned to the. Uh, the shortwave one band, uh, you can see the dial here, uh, what I have tuned. So, it's very easy to tune. And, uh, so this splitting the SW1 and SW2 helps in uh, precise digital frequency entry, so you can manually tune it. And propagation is better at night in SW1, as I said. During day, we can listen to SW2 stations. So I didn't cover medium wave uh, as it is more of a local station. Uh, so it is a, you can see medium wave is in kilohertz, whereas other uh, short wave was in meters. So medium wave is starting from 530 kilohertz to 1710 kilohertz. The modulation type used is uh, amplitude modulation. Wavelength is 182, approximately 565. It is a more, very commonly called as medium wave or uh, AM on most of the radios. And you can see 9 uh, kilohertz spacing. And uh, there are a lot of uh, medium wave uh, uh, stations like Vivid Bharti, FM Gold and regional stations so also we can get uh, 594 kilohertz channels i try to pick up now so now i am picking the medium wave from chennai that is uh, 594 uh, kilohertz so we have uh, we can pick up uh, medium wave signals from chennai delhi that is 729 1026 is from Bangalore and 1566 from Northport.
as you know the audio quality of uh, am is sorry the medium wave is lower than fm but uh, suitable for uh, news speech and music uh, and interviews and this also reception gets affected by weather and uh, location night time is the best to hear uh, again the medium wave so in the if i make comparison between medium wave short wave uh, and fm uh, fm is uh, the best audio quality stereo you can listen to music local and radio but the range is limited 50 kilometers short wave is the global using ionosphere with two international uh, stations catch can catch medium wave is regional up to 1000 kilometers at night in the date the range gets uh, affected thank you for watching stay tuned for more videos on radio i recommend i recommend uh, uh, to buy this radio uh, this is a very cost effective budget friendly uh, radio thank you for watching please do subscribe to my channel for more videos on radio